What's up guys, this is iTweaks here. And today I'm gonna to be showing you the highly anticipated theme called Iris. Now this is from the same developer of Icon, and a lot of people thought that Icon fell a little bit short in terms of living up to the expectations that everyone had. They thought that it was still a little too much iOS 6 on iOS 7. They just really didn't like that. So what Iris is supposed to do is bring that iOS 7 style look along with some subtle changes and hopefully make it look much, much better. Now, everyone is kind of getting on a bandwagon and saying that this is the best iOS 7 theme. Let me just start out by saying that I don't think that's true. Uh, I mean, you guys know that I like Aura the best. I've been using that in almost all of my videos. I also like Soft Remix. I mean, there's a lot of themes. Now, this is subtle changes. It's not going to completely redesign the way you feel about iOS 7. But let's go ahead and take a look at this because it still is a very good theme. So first, we're going to start off with the icons. So here we have some subtle changes. The uh, color scheme of the Messages app completely changed. The calendar icon right here, I mean, it's the smallest change. Uh, if you put them side by side, then you can kind of tell a difference. But really going through this, I had a difficult time actually figuring out if the icon was themed or not. That's how subtle some of the differences are on some of these icons. Now, they still look great. I mean, you can really tell a difference between the settings icon. I think that looks a whole lot better than the original iOS 7 icon. Uh, some of the other icons here, I mean, I like the way that it looks. But still, at the same time, I don't know that... I like them all they don't all fit in very well like the activator button I don't like gold so gold doesn't really match with anything for me except for white and unless you have a white and gold iPhone 5s then I mean it doesn't really fit into me so we're gonna swipe over here we're gonna take a look at some of the other icons that we have that have changed up a bit again subtlety is the main theme here now the color scheme that he used is actually pretty good I really enjoy uh, the way that everything kind of ties in together some of them kind of stick out you know like the maps icon here as well as let's swipe over here and we're gonna open up this folder and you can see that these are all themed as well the one I'm looking for is videos videos it's okay it's not the best icon also voice memos I'm not a huge fan of that uh, the reminders I mean it looks a little bit better again subtle changes so, I mean, it really just depends on what you think looks good. Do you want a subtle change for your iOS 7 icons? And if you do and you like these icons, then maybe you should check this out. Now, some of the other things that come with Iris are six different wallpapers. So we're going to go into settings here. And we're going to get out of this and go up to wallpapers. And you can see exactly what comes with it these six wallpapers right here so this is the one I'm using right now this is probably my favorite and we also have this one a more dull color right here one with flowers and this looks like some type of screen grading maybe over a bridge or something maybe and another blue one not sure what that is but uh, these are, I mean the wallpapers are great I like the wallpapers there's also some subtle differences in let's say the mail application so if we open up our mail and we go back here you can see some of the subtle changes that were made to the uh, mailbox icons right there also if we go into Safari you can see down here he actually changed up uh, what these icons look like a little bit now instead of having a square uh, right angle pointed edge he has rounded the edges off on the little share panel button here as well as on the tab icon now if you have Safari tab count which I do obviously you can see that it doesn't line up too great uh, the bookmarks button hasn't changed and I couldn't tell a difference anyways it looks pretty much exactly the same and that's maybe because it's already rounded off and not squared off and possibly the uh, arrows right here have changed. Again, I couldn't tell a difference. Uh, I've read that they have changed a little bit, but I really couldn't tell a difference. And here we're gonna go into the App Store. And if I didn't mention this before, this has over 150 icons in the theme. But you can see some of the differences down here, just the subtle changes. You can see the rounded edges right here and a different little uh, location indicator right there. Now that's also going to be right up here in the uh, 
mail or the status bar right there as you can see the location indicator right up there so i know a whole lot of people are going to enjoy this theme for me it's not the best theme but it is a good theme so let me know what you guys think about this theme in the comments below and if you enjoyed this video please hit that like button if you want to see more of my videos then go ahead and subscribe also don't forget to like my facebook page and follow me on twitter for updates and if you haven't checked out my gaming channel go over there and stop by and say hey all right guys until next time peace